All right, everybody, I got another letter in the mail. It is from Walt Wybrew, Woodwork, Woodworking. Um, he sent me a sticker and a little wooden uh, button, I guess you call it. I'm going to proudly display his button up here on the board. If I could get this off. Walt Wybrew Woodworking. Go check him out. He's got a nice channel. He does some, some awesome wood turning. Um, you won't regret it. Check him out. So I recently ran out of stickers, Walt, so I'll, uh, as soon as I, my stickers come in, I'll, I'll mail you one out, all right? Thank you. Hey guys, welcome. I'm going to do something a little bit uh, different for me. I usually don't uh, assemble kits, but I had these kits laying around for a couple years. The Legacy Christmas Tree Ornament Kits in gold. So it's just a little standard, fits on your standard um, hen mandrel. And it's a little gold finial and a little gold uh, loop, you know, so you can hang it in the tree. They're Christmas ornaments. Um, figured it's you know getting close to that season so I could I have I think five of them or something I'll start making them and and posting them so I have this nice little piece of cedar and this nice block of koa so those are the first two I'm gonna make I'll probably only uh, video one of them but um, it should be pretty cool stick around man so the first thing I'm gonna do is drill a hole through it it's uh, this is a 932nd drill bit I'm going to go ahead and drill, kind of found the center. I'm going to go ahead and scratch up these tubes. I have a medium CA. I scratched up these tubes so they, they uh, give the glue something to hold on to. I'm going to go ahead and be very generous with the glue. have one of those uh, flattener things so what I do is I just hit it on the sanding disc until I hit the, the metal My mandrel came with this little uh, coupling or whatever you want to call it and it's basically when you have shorter stuff like this you can attach it you tighten it on the on the rod it's like a little compression fitting then I put my spacer I put a couple spacers on this side and brass nut.
So I'm guessing this is the shape I'm going with. I'm gonna clean it up, uh, blow it off, clean it with some alcohol, cover it in um, sanding sealer, and then use my axe and break some paste. Let's get it done. Here's one, the cedar wood with the gold accents. It's pretty cool, it's pretty cool. This is really pretty. I'll give you guys some close-ups, all right? Thank you so much for watching. Um, I appreciate each and every one of you. Um, like, dislike, uh, leave a comment, share if you find it in your heart to share. Um, thank you guys so much. I'll be making a few more. I'll be throwing them on my uh, Etsy shop. So if you want to take a look at that there, more than welcome. Thank you so much. Shut up and sit down.